Welcome to my video. This is Akajin. Let's examine and analyze all the second anniversary packs in the store. I'll share my thoughts and reasoning. The first pack is the Senior Operator Training Pack. For $19.99, it contains 37 Originite Primes and the Training Invitation Letter, which instantly E2s any 5-star operator you use it on. Value-wise, based on just the OP, it's similar to the $15 pack if you still have the double bonus. For an additional $5, you get the OP plus this E2 promotional ticket. Overall, I'd say yes, this pack is worth it as E2 in a 5-star does cost quite a bit of sanity, materials, and LMD, which is all saved thanks to this ladder. To maximize its usage, it should be used on an operator that's E0 level 1 because you won't get any refunds for partial promotions or levels already invested. The OP to dollar ratio for this pack is 1.85. The next pack is the Duck Lord's Change Purse. For $6.99, it contains 13 Originite Primes and 300k LMD. This is equal to two of the $5 OP packs, or one if you still have the double bonus. So for another $2, you're getting the OP plus all this LMD. I would say this pack is optional because you're already getting lots of LMD from this event. So buying this pack for some OP and LMD seems unnecessary unless you need it for a skin or if you're on a promoting spree and you're running dry on money. The OP to dollar ratio for this pack is 1.86, same value as the training pack in terms of OP. The next pack is the upgrade pack. For $9.99, it contains 4,500 Arumdums which is the equivalent of 25 OP. Plus you get 160k LMD, two chip callus, and 50 skill summaries. It's basically the $15 pack, plus you get some money and some materials while saving $5. The OP to dollar ratio for this pack is 2.5. Really good value in this pack. All right, the next pack is the party pack, costing $29.99. It contains 24 OP, two 10 headhunting permits, LMD, battle records, and chips. The two permits work out to 67 OP, meaning we have a total of 91 OP from this pack. So it compares to the $50 pack, but you're also getting all the other goodies mentioned at a price of $30. So this is saving you $20 with the OP to dollar ratio of three, which is really damn good. Great value in this pack. And lastly, we have the carnival pack. For $50, you're looking at 90 OP, one 10 headhunting permits, LMD, and a crap ton of other stuff. With a total of 123 OP in this pack, it sits in between the $50 and $100 pack, being closer to the latter. The OP to dollar ratio for this pack is 2.46. Not as good as the party pack, but still decent value for sure. Overall, I consider the upgrade, party, and carnival packs to be extremely good. It's worth it for your money. The training pack is also a good pick because you'll save a lot of sanity and resources for the instant E2 promotion of your five-star operator. And the Duck Lord pack, I classify as optional. All right, those are my thoughts on the second anniversary packs. Let me know what you think. Am I correct with my analysis or were my thoughts just dog water? And if you bought any packs, which one did you buy? Comment down below. As always, my social links will be in the video description. Be sure to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Peace out.